The current from a cell goes from the positive terminal all the way around to the negative terminal. It continues to move around the circuit in a single direction. We call this type of current a direct current or DC current if it does not change direction. And the size of the voltage is always the same, it's constant. To represent a direct current on a graph, we have voltage and time. This straight line shows a constant voltage that is only going in a single direction. Solar cells, car batteries, dry batteries, they all provide a direct current. The mains electrical supply from your wall socket, they deliver what's called an alternating current, or AC current. The mains power supply is drawn using this symbol. The current from this power supply alternates in two directions. In the United Kingdom, the current switches directions 50 times each second. So here in the UK, AC current has a frequency of 50 Hz. It has a maximum voltage of 230 volts. In the United States, their mains voltage is much, much lower, 120 volts. To represent the AC current on the voltage time graph, the voltage rises and falls. This shows that the current is going forwards and backwards. The peaks show the maximum voltage, which is 230 volts. So you can see that in an alternating current, the voltage size changes constantly. I'm going to post more videos on electricity. Be sure to subscribe.